James Elder, Eiffel TV, MTK Oof. Global. We've got Paul Highland Jr. after an absolute brilliant contest against Steve Ormond. Uh, Getting the decision here tonight, how, how do you think it went? Uh, static, um, burning fight, uh, close fight. Tough, I uh, kind of got a tougher person for defence in that title, but a uh, uh, very brilliant night, really. Tough, tough fight, as you mentioned. Best we've seen Ormond look in the last few outings as well. Yeah. He looked great at the weight tonight. Yeah, well, that's it. I was totally training hard for it. Um, so I'd rather beat a, a good Steve Norman than beat a one well, who just wanted to turn up. He put a ring in on his shoulder. Mm -hmm. He came at me and I threw my back and just, just won me there, just negatively. Real close fight. You had Ormond yeah. down in the fight as well. At that point, did you think oh, you're going to go in for the kill and get him yeah, out of there? Yeah, they did. I uh, caught him yeah, through the jab and threw the right hand over the tap. He didn't see it coming. He went down. And I seen him get up and went for the ropes and I seen the legs go, so went straight in, but he's experienced, he's fought by level, he's, you know what to do, he dug deep, so he didn't, he held on. You knew it was a close fight coming into that 12th round, yeah. when the final bell went, was you confident that you had done enough to get the decision? Yeah, yeah. I was confident that my boxing his skills had won me the fight, uh, I knew it was close, um, it was a bit sore in the last couple of rounds from the, the, the clash of heads and stuff, he's got me a few heads and love me here. <laughs> From, from Robin Hanks, but uh, yeah, I felt confident in the answer then. Just a bit sore, as I say. Great fight, talking to Ormond and Pascoe after. They were pretty convinced that they'd done enough to get the decision themselves. Yeah. Um, did you think the 1-1-7-1-10 one, 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 scorecard was a bit wide? It have been a wee bit weird, yeah. He, he, he won a f probably won a few more rounds than what they say, but I do believe that I won it, and the judges' eyes won it, and the, f the crowd's eyes won it. But at the end of the day, he was there in my face for 12 rounds, I was in his face, the crowd loved it, so did it. Um, and I've got this belt back, that's him and him. What's the plan going forward from here for Paul Highland Jr? Uh, what do you want to do now? The plan, um, British title route, Commonwealth route, but a Brazil in front of me, I want to take it on me. I can just bring in manager Mark Dunlop. Yep. Firstly, right. sir, how do you assess off. tonight's performance? I thought it was very, very good, it was a great defence. I had it nip and tuck, I had it closer than the score of the dodgy score, you know, I thought the two boys have great respect for each other, it was a fan fight, toe to toe, great stuff, it, we, only, we only found out it was a 12 rounder like yesterday afternoon, hey, no, no problem, no problem, and the last two rounds won on the fight, I had it, I had it personally all level get into the last round, and, uh, and I, I think he won the last round comfortably, and I'm delighted, and the two guys are great, and Steve Roman is, is a real Stalwart, he's a fantastic guy, and this whole team are great. You know, we'll win some, we'll lose some, but the head will push on now. We'll, we'll take Lewis Ritson, we'll take Meister Dodds, whoever, it doesn't really matter. We're going to be a champion, you've got to fight them all anyway. So, and they can prove they can do 12 rounds. You know, Meister can do 12 rounds, can Ritson do 12 rounds? You know, that's it. Well, would you like a shot at Lewis Ritson for his first British defense? Team. Is that something that excites you? Yeah, by the time I'm safe for a while, I want that British head belt, that long tail belt, a prestigious belt everyone wants out, and I've been a map that belt league now. Yep. Sure, there's fights that can be made for you at the weight, you know. Yeah. Scott Cardinal's itching to get himself back into the mix at title yeah. contention. So, yeah. again, there's fights yeah. in and around. Well, whoever's are, whatever's the best route for me, um, whatever's the best option for me for the the, the head down my forward, yep. Mm -hmm. Everyone. Congratulations on the win. Thank you. Thank you for talking to our full TV. It's a great pleasure to get you lads on the channel. Cheers, cheers. And we look forward to seeing you out from here on in. Thank you. Cheers, man. Cheers, Paul.